Okay guys, now let's solve this problem. It might seem a little bit complex and complicated to you, but to remind you, this is a very very basic and simple problem. So let's move on. A boat having a length 3 meter and breadth 2 meter is floating on a lake. The boat sinks by 1 centimeter when a man gets on it, the mass of the man. It sounds to be very much complicated problem, but again you need to imagine uh, the geometrical shape here. The shape here we are talking about, a boat, let's imagine a boat here as a simply, uh, simply a, a cuboidal kind of shape thing, right? So it's, a, it's a very, very basic, so it's, it's the, so the volume will be length into breadth into height, right? So that, that's going to be, that's going to be it, right? So, 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 so volume here should be length into breadth into height, this is the volume. Now what are the different, uh, different parameters that are provided the length is provided c meter uh, and this is also meters this is in centimeters so we need to con convert this one into meter so anyways so here it is provided that the length here is c meter the breadth here is 2 meter and th the boat sinks by 1 centimeter that is uh, the height in this case right so that's how we need to follow the heights because they not always tell you the correct way uh, the exact term for it. So it's one centimeter, we need to convert it into a meter. So one centimeter, if we convert it into meter, it will be 0 0.01 meter. So we get the height. So once we get length, breadth and height, we can calculate the volume. So the volume here is 3 into 2 into 0 0.01 and it will give us 6 into 0 0.01. So 0 0.06 meter cube is the volume, right? So we get the volume. But what, what is the question? When a person is get on get, get onto this boat, it sinks by one centimeter. So what is the mass of that man? So mass of that man. Here comes the most important point of this question. So mass of the man here is equals to volume of water. So 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 the formula here is volume of water displaced volume of water displaced into into uh, here is, is is the density of the water that's why we need to calculate into the density of the water that's the formula we need to in, in multiply this volume with density of the water that's how we get our answer so what is the density of water here? The density of water definitely 1000. So once if it, if nothing is provided, we need to assume that yes, the density of water will always be 1000 uh, meter, so, so uh, cubic meter again in that case. So, so if this is the density, so what is going to be the answer? So volume displaced is 0 0.06 into the density is 1000. So here, this is going to be the weight of the man, that is in kg. So it will be 60 kg. So the weight of the man here is 60 kg, so option B should be the correct answer. So it found to be very much difficult, but you need to know this formula, that is volume of water displaced into uh, the density of water. And the density of water is 1000, is found to be 1000 in this case, and that's how you get this answer correctly, right? So that's it guys, and I hope that's helpful. Thank you.